Perillo. Welcome back. Well, a beautiful Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there. Hello, mom. I'm watching you as well and thinking about you. Weather-wise, couldn't ask for better today, and it looks like we have another nice couple of days before we see a fundamental change in our weather pattern. We'll talk more about that in just a bit. First off, let's take a look outside. Clear skies, nice breeze out of the north, northeast. Just a beautiful day today. Temperatures topping out at 78, the official high after a morning morning start at 57 and tonight cooler and tomorrow it's going to be a little bit warmer. Look at this temperatures by tomorrow morning. Some of the models getting us into the low to mid 50s, so that's going to be crisp and cool. Great sleeping weather for sure. Then tomorrow, mostly sunny skies. It warms up tomorrow afternoon. We should be a few degrees warmer, lower 80s or high. Then as we head into Tuesday, we're going to see a return of that southeasterly wind, but overall a dry pattern, uh, but it will be milder at morning and warm during the afternoon. And then as we head into the latter part of Tuesday, and Wednesday breezy, warm and humid as we look ahead to uh, uh, what we're going to see. Maybe even a few showers Wednesday afternoon. Southwest Louisiana will go with rain chance at about 20% locally for us, a little bit higher over towards Southwest Louisiana. Now, as we take a look at the European model moisture, blue and purple means super dry, so nice dry weather. But notice Wednesday we start to see an influx of that Gulf moisture, and that will continue for Thursday into Friday uh, and then as we get into the weekend, it looks like some of that moisture eases kind of parks in the western Gulf of Mexico, so we have to keep an eye on that as some of that moisture could come our way. And then of interest, and the models have been indicating this, both GFS and European model, maybe a little bit of an area of low pressure developing off the southeast U.S., so we'll have to watch that. Could be a little bit of a tropical hybrid system, so uh, nothing to get too worried about, but also if that should develop, it actually brings in drier air here as we go 9, 10 days down the road but a uh, significant change in the pattern for sure on the way. Tonight, though, here's the good stuff. Lower 50s, your low. Northern parishes will favor a uh, low to mid 50s. I-10 quarter, 54 about in Lafayette and mid 50s for the most part along the coast. Cameron right by the water is going to be milder. Then after that cool start, it warms up nicely. Upper 70s to lower 80s tomorrow. Not as cool tomorrow night. Upper 50s will favor to lower 60s. Maybe the last night we see in the 50s tomorrow night. And then as we head into Tuesday, a few degrees warmer yet. And that trend continues in the 10 day forecast. So as we mentioned, great sleeping weather. Nice and cool out there. 54 the low. 66 is our normal low this time of year. So that's 12 degrees below normal and then tomorrow great start to the week fair skies could see a few high level cirrus clouds but mostly sunny skies 81 your high 83 on Tuesday looking good then warm and humid for the rest of the week pretty good rain chances developing by Thursday and scattered daytime showers and thunder showers in the forecast through the weekend and beyond with highs staying parked in the 80s that's it for weather for right now we'll be right back right after this